Activities at Early Childhood Centers in Ghana, Observations of Early Childhood Teacher Trainees. This article is written by Ahmed of July. This study looked at activities at early childhood education centers in Ghana in the areas of nature and use of curriculum, environmental conditions, pedagogical practices, and the nature and use of assessment. Using the quantitative research approach, 136 final year early childhood teacher trainees engaged in teacher internship practice in the 10 regions of Ghana administered a researcher designed observation checklist to a number of early childhood centers in the country. Findings that emerged were that participants were fairly satisfied with teaching and learning conditions at the different early childhood centers they visited, and that the curriculum used at the centers were relevant, meaningful and based on learners' prior experiences. The early childhood environment was described as one that enhanced teaching and learning. Pedagogical practices as seen by participants was one that promotes learning, and also assessment tools were described as encouraging and appropriate. Despite this encouraging information presented by participants, shortfalls such as a one-fit-all curriculum, learners not allowed to learn at their own pace, lack of space for private learning at classrooms, as well as lack of parental involvement in evaluating assessment data also emerged in the findings. Based on these, the study provides a number of recommendations of which include the need for flexible curriculum to carry on barred all learners, the need for training for educators in the area of manipulating the curriculum to meet individual learner needs and also a rethink of early childhood classroom architectural design to accommodate the learning needs of all levels of learners. Thanks for watching this abstract video of Asian Journal of Education and Training Volume 3 Issue Number 1 published by Asian Online Journal Publishing Group.